All right, YouTubers, unboxing video time. So this should be uh, some RAM that I bought. And uh, I would say this is probably the cheapest RAM on Amazon. Uh, 3000 megahertz. DDR4, 288 pin. Oloy, or Oloy, however you say that. Um, I think it was $28 which still is not as good a deal as the lightning deal I got for uh, 16 gigs of RAM, the RGB one that I just did recently. So uh, we're gonna go ahead and uh, get this open and uh, assuming I can do it with one hand, I might not be able to. Um, and I'm going to uh, run the user benchmark on it and let you guys see what uh, what kind of scores it gets um, by itself and if it drags down um, the other RAM that I have that's 3000 megahertz. So see whether this is a good buy or not. All right, so got out the packaging. Got the packaging open. I can get it out of here. And I noticed on Amazon, they, people are complaining about how poorly these are packed for shipping, but uh, this one seems all right. So let's go ahead and install it and uh, see what it does. All right, so first one we're gonna do, it's installed next to my other 3000 megahertz RAM. We're gonna go ahead and see how it does with these other ones. So we should see an improvement hopefully in our score. All right, so um, it definitely recognizes the fact we have the additional eight gigs of RAM in here. All right, so sadly, as a team, it actually brought our uh, scores down, uh, 80.6. So let me find so 97.3 down to 80.6. Um, that's kind of unexpected, to be honest with you, that it would be worse. Um, and therefore, I'm not sure I will be able to recommend this RAM they're watching this video, but uh, let's look at these scores here. 28 and 25.9. And much more, uh, much better scores when it's just the two uh, by themselves. So next I'm going to pull the RAM out of this thing uh, and we'll just have the one 8 gigabyte stick. All right, so we got the single stick in here. Wow, so this RAM score is uh, is pretty terrible, to be honest with you, compared to the other two RAM that I have. Um, I'm not very impressed at all. So we compare this um, cheap Amazon stuff to a single stick next of the uh, RAM that I had in here originally. All right, so we've got a single stick of the XPG RGB RAM in there, and uh, we'll just see how this compares. All right, so here is a single stick of the XPG RAM. And, uh, you know, it's honestly makes the other one not look as bad. Um, so 51.1 overall for that, where this guy was 48.4. So... Uh, what does that tell you? Um, at least in this case, it would appear that though the cheaper RAM is uh, pretty lousy, uh, that it's not as, as bad as it looks. So, the other thing left to do is buy another stick of it. See how it compares 16 gig wise. Hey, thanks for checking out the video.